Flight boss, bitch. You know, for sure. You know, listen to the mind of that Terry's moon. I am the royal archangel Uriel, and I'm here to carry God duties and motherfucker responsibilities. And this video right here is going to be about why being too goddamn understanding can motherfucking hurt you. Let me repeat. Why being too motherfucking understanding can motherfucking hurt your monkey ass. Now, look, check this out. Here's the thing, because you don't know what the fuck you standing up under. And you could be standing up under somebody's motherfucking heavy ass trash bag log of motherfucking depression, insecurities, unstable morality systems, fucked up ass flunked out virtues and principles, and they just fucking dumb, deaf, blind, sheep, and weak in a flunked out ass circumstance or situation dealing with flunked out ass people places and things so they like tanned out they yoffed out they quoffed out you know what i'm saying they, they don't even they like put themselves and added a zero so they put themselves into more space so now they really into third dimension now with their individuality and they don't see nothing no other way but that kind of structure so life is hard for them but look check this out right Check this out. When you in a situation when you being too under motherfucker standing, this when you understanding, this when you need to learn how to be a little bit overstanding and learn how to be a little bit understanding. Understanding is when you learn yourself, learn your own fucking moves a little bit. Overstanding is when you know how to look over the situation from an objective point of view. Or if we don't want to use the word objective, use a word like you're trying to see the situation from all parameters. You know what I'm saying? Not get fixated in one way of how the situation may be or how the outcome may play out. And keyword may. So this puts you into a situation where having understanding and overstanding and outerstanding, knowing how to separate from the situation as a whole, not caring to look over it as an overstanding, not caring to see how you relate to it and how you deal with it and how you manifested it and how to get uh and how to get out of it and things, aka your inner the uh your inner standing, you know what I'm saying? As a spirit, outer standing is just when you just separating yourself and you don't you just can't deal with it. You ain't got time to deal with it. you ain't got to, I ain't got that to do. You know what I'm saying? Like some kind of shit like that. So for the most part just put you in a situation where when you're too understanding, all those go out the window. Outer standing, go out the window because you feel like you are a part of something. And this person probably put you on a guilt trip. So outer standing, go out the window. Inner standing, go out the window because you know what you want. You know what you don't like. You know you don't want to take this monkey-ass person uh, to where they got to go or whatever like that. But for the most part, whatever they got you flunked out in, make you feel like they have to understand this, that, and the third. You know what I'm saying? That gives you flunked out where goddamn it all inner standing is out the window. And then motherfucking all um overstanding be out the window because you can look over the situation all you want. But if you ain't crawling yourself out of the situation, you just as bad as the motherfucking person who participating in. And two wrongs don't make it right. Just because one on the other right on the other side and they got the light. You see what I'm saying? So keep that in motherfucking mind. Also, here's another thing you need to understand. Well, uh, being too motherfucker understanding, especially when it comes to depressed and heavy load ass motherfucker spirits that are Block you down also with their fucking spiritual ankle blockages. This is what you need to understand also, right? This puts you into a motherfucking situation where a lot of times these people will, they put you so much with your spiritual back against the wall or put it in a corner somewhere where, goddamn it, you're in a position where you have to understand everything and they goddamn drunk ass auntie, crack headed ass uncle, still generational curse ass dealing with mama and a motherfucker, 100 miles an hour up and down the street, still going to jail, prison, and Alcatraz ass fucking daddy. You got to understand all that shit, but here, when it comes to you and what happened to your life, and when you do something wrong, ain't no form of understanding. Yet, when these motherfuckers do something wrong, or when these motherfuckers is in a situation or in a jam or something like that, they expect you to already understand every flaunted out thing that even in their own mind. And I ain't even know we were supposed to be mind readers in this motherfucker, but they let you know all this motherfucker shit and things like that. So it gets motherfucking crazy and spooky out here in these esoteric streets. You need to motherfucking understand when we start to talk about this goddamn energy. Yeah. Goddamn, I'm just get to delete the last fucking videos, but yay! You know what I'm saying? It's tricky. Be careful who the fuck you uphold and trying to stand up under their goddamn shit. Because here's the thing. When you around motherfuckers that you always understanding, right there, put your motherfucker spiritual back against the motherfucker wall and make you understand everything in it that's going on in the motherfucking life. A.K.A. everything that's dealing with they fucking still generational curse, dealing with ass mama, motherfucker, they crackheaded ass uncle, they hundred thousand miles an hour up and down the motherfucker street, still going to jail and prison ass Alcatraz daddy. And also motherfucker, they crack, they still drunk ass uncle. No, don't forget, we ain't forget they aren't they crack it ass uncle either. 
You know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna, we ain't gonna forget them. But at the same time, like I said, they have you feeling like, damn, you gotta understand everything about them and other, everything that's about going on in their fucking world and shit like that. But when it's time for you to need some understanding, when it's time for you to need a helping hand, when you do something wrong, oh, it's World War motherfucking 3, oh, it's World War motherfucking 87. You need to understand that motherfucking shit. And they put your ass in a motherfucking situation where it seemed like that, yeah, you understand. You supposed to understand and read their mind all the motherfucking time. But when it's time for you to need some motherfucker uh uh con consoling and 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 some understanding and overstanding and all that motherfucker shit, oh hell nah. They ain't got none, they ain't got none of that for you. They ain't got none of that for you. So peep motherfucking game like I say it. Be careful who the fuck that if it ain't motherfuckers you actually care about and they giving you the same motherfucking energy, be careful who you motherfucker trying to understand in this motherfucker because you might be stand, standing up under some shit that you can't motherfucking uphold and your spirit just end up being damaged. And your spirit can't really be damaged, but it's going to feel that way if you believe you have to uphold all that bullshit that a motherfucker trying to make you stand up under. Always remember that motherfucker shit. It takes belief first, and that's the only way it's going to manifest. And I love you from the bottom of my heart. Eee, real shit. Shit, you gotta believe.